Hey guys, it's me Kayla Lachey and I'm back with a video here for the channel and it's a little bit of a different style video, okay? I was planning to do, you know, my September favorites because, you know, we're now in October and I just realized like, yo, Kayla, you don't really have a lot of things to show for an entire video. And at the same time, I also had stuff that I wanted to haul for you, but it wasn't a ton of stuff, again, for its own video. So I was like, let's just mush the two together. <laughs> I'm going to start really quickly with Topshop because I ended up picking up one item there last week and this is such a basic staple and it's such a Kayla item because hello it's black and I'm surprised I don't really have on like black today except for my little tank top. I was in need of some more crop style shirts and I've been loving cut off shirts like this but I also love this one as soon as I tried it on because it has like a slight turtleneck effect and I thought it was just absolutely perfect forever. 21. Alright, so I needed to get another pair of leather shorts. Currently, I wanted a pair that was high-waisted, and these are exactly it. They were only $17.90, and I love the material of these. It's a little bit softer, and it also has lining in the inside, so it's super comfy. And I feel like leather shorts are a basic essential. I'm still on the hunt for leather leggings, uh, but I haven't really found a pair that fit and hug my body, you know, perfectly the way that I feel like they should so I definitely picked these up as soon as I saw them another company that I have to share with you guys is profound aesthetic you can find their stuff from urban outfitters you can also order them on their website so I have a beanie here which you guys saw in a couple of my Instagram photos that just features an American flag on the front actually this is the back I wear it backwards sometimes and then on the other side it just says profound as featured in my Instagram and I also have here here one of their baseball shirts and it says just profound on the front with again the flag and I really love it because it has embroidered details to it patches and it's just a very casual piece but you can definitely style it different ways I also here have yoga pants because for me I live in yoga as I'm wearing a pair of yoga pants right now and they're just an essential. You will find me wearing yoga pants 99.9% .9 of the time. So my favorite company is Cory Vines. I've shopped there before. These are just the essential leggings in black and I ended up getting two pairs of these because my current ones were just, I wore them so much. You guys like, you don't even wanna see what they look like now. They go all the way down to your ankles. So I got two pairs of those. Here's the second pair. I just love yoga pants. So great. I also got a pair of the essential cropped leggings in black, which are the ones that I have on right now. And I love the crop style. I'm sad that I didn't get two pairs of those. And the last pair of yoga pants that I ordered was the Path print legging in the crop style and these ones are actually navy blue but they have a funky dotted pattern on them love these i love the cory vine leggings because they make your bum look like so good like so good to wrap up the haul portion of this video i went to mac cosmetics one of my favorite makeup brands i ran out of things so that kind of you know drove me to the store to pick up items that were definitely essentials like this which is their brush cleanser nobody likes a dirty brush so this is my favorite spot cleaner to use on my eyeshadow brushes and liner brushes just to quickly clean them on the spot and we also have here my favorite eyeliner which is the mac fluid line in the color black track i know you guys ask me all the time on my instagram photos you know what eyeliners do i use because my eyeliner is very dramatic I love to do just like a thick wing and that's just like my signature go-to look it has been for months now and I just love using this product because it's the easiest for me to use it's just a gel consistency and I'll go in with uh, like a Sigma makeup brush to apply it to my eyes and I ran out of that completely so I had to get that for sure because I was dying without it basically and I'm sure you guys have been asking me you know what is on your lips this color is so dark so I recently picked up a new duo for this season because I was looking for a darker lip combo and I saw this one online I looked up swatches and I was like oh my god yes I need that in my life and this here is cyber by Mac again you guys have been really asking me you know on Instagram what color is on your lips this is the lipstick cyber It's described as being a blackish purple so it's really dark but it still has a tint of color to it which is why I like it so I'll go ahead and swatch that for you 
and it just looks like that. I like this because you can really play up the intensity. You can make it so much darker and deeper depending on the lip liner that you'll pair with it. The lip liner that I got, which again is what I have on with this, is Night Moth. I think that these two go very well together. They're definitely a perfect combo. So there is the swatch of the lip liner Night Moth on the bottom there. The only thing I don't like about wearing dark lipstick is you really have to watch it, um, whether it be bleeding or feathering. And also, you know that piece of skin on your lip, the inside, that's like moist? The lipstick doesn't stick to that, so sometimes it can look a little bit strange. Do you guys have any tricks to fix that issue? Do you even know what I'm talking about? Because I feel like I'm not doing a good job describing you know my issue here but there's like a piece of skin that's always wet where the color doesn't really stick to you so it can look a little funky on to the next part of this video would be my monthly favorites for September so I'm gonna start with a candle I slightly mentioned this in my daily vlog and it's the Bath and Body Works marshmallow fireside candle and this Oh, I have no words to describe my love for this and it is the candle that instantly reminds me of fall and winter and everything that just makes me feel cozy and warm and at home. So this, just go get it. If you have never had this, you need it in your life. Just do yourself a favor, please, for all of us. Oddly enough, I only have like three favorites for makeup items, and one of them is a lipstick. This is Diva by MAC, and I actually used this in my Get Ready With Me Fall Edition video, and I said that this was Rebel by mistake, but it's actually Diva, and it's just a deep red, and I feel like a deep red is definitely necessary for fall, and for September, I definitely got my use out of this color, and I'm gonna be getting more use out of it for sure because it's just so beautiful. Liquid Leather by China Glaze. It's just your basic standard creamy black nail polish. Definitely an essential for me and pretty much I'm going to be wearing this every day of my life. So I had to include this in this video because I have it on right now and I love it oh so much. And my last and final favorite would be an eyeshadow palette by Urban Decay. And this is their Smoked palette, which I don't like the packaging because you have to zip it, which I think is really weird. Like, what? But the colors inside make it worth using because they're all smoky shades. Most of them are neutral, but you do get three colors down here, like blue, green, and a purple to play around with. But personally, I really like using this one, which is called Backdoor, mixed with this one, which is called... Am I going blind? Barlust. And also two of the other colors here, we have Freestyle and Kinky, just soft neutrals that are both mattes that are great for eyebrow highlights and crease work. So I've been loving this palette, you guys, and it just, it's perfect. I don't know if it's still on sale, but if it is, go get it. So yeah, those are like my favorites. I only had four of them, which is why I couldn't do an entire video on my September faves. Quickly, I do wanna let you guys know about my vlogging channel. So if you don't see a video on this channel, it's because I'm uploading on that account as well, a Kdoll X2, pronounced a Kdoll times two if you wanna be hip. So I hope you dolls tune in and subscribe to that channel for more videos to come. I love to daily vlog because it lets you guys know, like, I'm a real person, I have feelings, this is what my life is like. These are the people I hang out with. This is what I'm doing on, you know, a normal weekly basis and all that fun stuff. So definitely recommend checking that out. I will put the link down below in the description bar of this video. Make sure you guys are following me on Twitter if you are not already because I tweet you guys back all the time. Retweets and favoriting and all that fun stuff. It's the best way for you guys to get in touch with me and send me messages and fun things like that. So I hope you guys check that out as well. I will put my link down below to my Twitter page and that's pretty much everything for this video today thanks for tuning in I will see you guys next time with another video super super soon and um, take care